Hey, hey, Larperinos, it is Arby from Science and Swords once again. If you looked at our last video, you might recall that Minion K was missing. She's still missing, and uh, that's because this is actually only 10 minutes after the last video. We had some customers come in. So, uh, you know, previous rules still apply, or, you know, something legal, maybe just bring in some Christmas cards. If you're coming into the shop, bring Minion K some Christmas cards. Christmas with a K. All K, all the time. So, let's get back to what we're actually supposed to be doing in these videos, which is checking out new products. So, next from Epic Armory, uh, what's in the box? More box! But what's in this box? I think you guys know where this is going. I'm gonna exhibit this. It's War Box. No, uh, what this actually is, is the new uh, Roman helmet. So you've probably seen the old Roman helmet, quite a nice little sort of legionnaire sort of thing. Basically, looks like this. Uh, as I mentioned in the previous video, we're at the new point of some assembly required, and that's what box number three is here. This is really well taped up. Oh, so glad I've got fingernails at the moment. Hey, we've got our nice big horsehair plume. So, oh man, if these came in black or silver, the Eldar would go absolutely spaz. Uh, once again, it's one of those ones that will require a little bit of unscrewing, so just going to need to get out a little wrench or something. Oh no, it's actually so oily that, yeah, you, you know what, it's so oily that you will need a wrench because trying to get this to come off is just nightmarish with my fingers. Uh, but you get the idea. Horsehair plume goes on like so, and then you bolt it back down, and you've got yourself a nice big brushy helmet in true style. What else we got? Well, as I mentioned in the previous one, there was supposed to be the joke where you know, Kay and I were rocking off together with the new chain skirt. That's right, chain mail, not just for the dudes anymore. Alternatively, skirts, not just for the ladies in the Scottish anymore. Alternatively, it's just some chainmail, guys. Wear it how you like it, and it's more comfortable than chainmail pants. Ugh. Oh god, it's you know, it's chainmail, of course it's heavy, but I really did not expect it to be as quite as heavy as this. Huh. So let's see. Let me sort of shimmy our way in, and we got the shoulder straps over there. I should have done that the other way. Ugh. Man, getting dressed in the mornings is just such a chore. So it goes on real simple. We got two buckles, sorry, two straps that buckle in. Uh, that go over the shoulders and then to tighten things up there is also just a strap at the waist. Please do not laugh at my self-squiring stance. It's the only way to keep these on without assistance. Cool. And then to take the weight off your shoulders because it is a fair bit of weight going to the shoulders. We've got belt. Now this belt needs to sit above your hips. So guys, this might be a little bit problematic for some of you. Those of you that just are not blessed with, you know, glorious childbearing hips such as myself. It's uh, it's both a blessing and a curse. Let's get this on. Oh wow, for once I'm actually smaller than an Epic Armory Lodge. I have been losing weight. It's all those shakes I keep drinking. You know that just because you shake your booze doesn't mean you're drinking a shake, right? Yes, according to uh, the staff, if you couldn't hear that over the microphone, uh, shaken martinis do not count as health shakes. Okay, so I need to tighten that up on the shoulders a bit actually. It's sitting way too low. <laughs> Heck, that's uh, 
That is a mighty suspect hole sitting right there. That's that's a that's a target zone and a half. That's a that's an invitation to pikemen. Uh, wow. So, fellas, if you're buying the chain skirt, I'd say consider investing in a cup. Uh, but other than that, it's actually the weight's not so bad now that it's actually cinched up correctly. Um, yeah, good range of mobility. You're going to have some issues if you're, you know, at one of those events that allows kicking or if you just, you know, feel like kicking. That's, uh, that's not happening, at least not without busting some rivets. Maybe if you uh, were to carve down there. But yeah, otherwise, chain skirt, pretty good. Anything else arrived recently? Oh yes, one last thing. Short and sweet. So, because this is Melbourne and black is basically the uniform, We've listened to people demanding that the sword bags come in black. There you go. You can now have your goth Kirito or Sephiroth sword in its official goth bag. There you have it guys. So, hopefully uh, you'll come in, you'll check out some of the new products, you'll try them, you'll like them. Uh, we've been working hard on you know, suggesting stuff to Epic Armory to make sure that products suit your needs. We'll see you guys on the battlefield.